everyone, welcome back. This is Dan from DHTV and today I'm going to be showing you where your keychain passcodes are stored and how you can access them on your Mac. Let's get started. All right, so from our Mac, what we want to do is open up the keychain access application and we'll start by clicking on the launch pad and then the other folder and you should see keychain access right there. If for any reason you don't see it, you can always search for keychain access at the top using the search and then just click on it to open it. So this is keychain access and it does look a little bit intimidating, but that's okay because we're only going to focus on our accounts. So on the left side, click on the iCloud section and this is going to show you all the accounts you have set up with your iCloud keychain all synced between your iOS devices that use the same iCloud account. So your iPhones, iPads, your Macs, anything that's using this account with Keychain, you'll be able to see them here. So obviously to protect my privacy, I have a lot of them blocked off. But for example, I'll show you my Instagram right here. If we click on it, you can see the name Instagram.com. You can see your account name, DHTV Tech. So head on over to Instagram and follow me there. On the right side, you'll see the type of password it is. So a web form, internet password. If it's an application password, it'll all be displayed there. Additionally, at the top, you're going to see all of your account information once again. Now to change the password for any one of these accounts, all you have to do is simply double click on the one you want to change. It'll open up this window here where once again, you can see your account information. We're going to focus on the show password section. So we're going to check the box will be prompted to enter in our computer password here so that we can access it. So enter that in and then it'll display the password. Once again, I'm blocking it out to protect my privacy here, but you'll see the password you use for that specific account. You can also change the password just by clicking in the box and typing in a new password, or you can click on this little key icon to the right. And this is going to help you select a password that's a little bit more secure than what you might be using. And this is particularly helpful if you use the same password for all of your accounts. It's never recommended to do that. So you can select from the type, you can choose letters and numbers, numbers only, random obviously will give you the best quality and you can choose the length here as you go higher. You can see that the quality of the password, it improves as well. We'll close it. If you do choose to save that password, you'll be prompted here to save the new password and we're just going to say don't save for now. So that is it. That's pretty much how you find your keychain passcode on your Mac. Don't forget to check out the iOS version of this video, which will show you how to find your keychain passcode on your iPhone or iPad. Also, if you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comment box below and I'll do my best to help you out. If you enjoyed this video, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to be notified when I post new videos. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.